Hello friends, in this tutorial uh, I am going to discuss how to remove duplicate element from an unsorted array. So this is uh, an unsorted array which contain duplicate element and this is the output which contain only unique element. So in this tutorial I am going to discuss three approaches and their time complexity to solve this problem. So let's discuss all the three approaches then we will see their java code implementation so the first approach is to sort this array when uh, first sort the array and then we can easily remove duplicate element from an array so let's see so this is my unsorted array and once i sort the array then the output become like this and after that if i compare i and i plus one then if the value if both the values is different then i keep them in an array else i'll move to uh, next element so let's see how uh, we can remove duplicate element from sorted array so i i have declared one variable j and initialize with zero then i am start traversing an array so if the value present at index i and i plus 1 is different so my ith index so is uh, so f initial value of i is 0 so ith index the value present at ith index is 1 and the value present at i plus 1 index is 2 so both are different so what I am doing is I am keeping the value at so initial value of j is 0 so 0th index the value of array i so I will just put one here and after that i incremented the value of j so the value of j becomes one then in next iteration i compared two with four so both are different so i keep i put the value of two here and the value of j becomes two then i compare four with four which is same so this condition is false then in next iteration four is compared with five so i keep 4 here and the value of j becomes 3 then I compared 5 with 5 uh, which is equal so this condition is false then in next iteration 5 is compared with 6 so it's true then 5 is put here and after this loop uh, the last element we have not yet touched the last element so I put the last element in this array so in this way we get only the unique element we remove the duplicate element from unsorted array so first sort the array then traverse an array and compare i with i plus one if both are not equal then we keep the value in an array so if i traverse an array from zero to j and print the element I get only unique element so this is the first approach the second up and the time complexity for this approach is o and log n so the the sorting algorithm we use to sort the array gives uh, me the sorted array in n log n time and after that I'll just traverse the array and filter uh, the unique element so I keep only unique element now uh, let's come to the second approach the second approach is to use hash map so hash map is used for storing key and value pairs so in map key is always unique for this tutorial just keep it simple hash map so it's store it it is used for storing key and value pairs so so let's see how this method works so suppose I have a table in which I keep key and its value so let's say this so let's draw like this and this so when I traverse an array so what's the first element in an array 5 so I initialize initial value to 1 so I'll get 5 
once in an array uh, until now so i am starting traversing an array then the next element is one so the value of one is one then the next value is two so let's say two i'll get once then six i'll get six once then the next element is four and i'll get four one time then the next value is four so what's the current value of four is one so i'll get four one more time so now the value is two and now the next element is five so i'll get five already uh, once now it's it becomes two so it is key key is my array element and value is number of time it occurs in an array so in map key is always unique so we if suppose one is present three times in an array so we get key is one and its value is three similarly five is present twice in an array so the key is five and its value is two so the key is always unique so this key is unique so if i traverse uh, a map and print in its key then i'll always get a unique element so so the time complexity for this approach is o n so now let's move to our next approach and which is set data structure so set is a data structure which stores only unique element so if i traverse this array and put them in a set i i mean i'll add each element in a set then only unique element is get added so if i add 5 then 1 then 2 then 6 then 4 now the next occurrence is 4 so 4 is added only once similarly 5 is added only one and once we added the each element of an array in a set and then we print the value we only get unique elements so the time complexity of this approach is also o n so these are the three approaches through which we can uh, remove duplicate element from an unsorted array so let's see uh, the java code implementation so this is my first method uh, which is uh, first uh, sort the array and then a filter only unique element so I have sorted the array and then I'll traverse an array and check if ith index is not equal the value present at i index is not equal to i plus one then I'll add the value in an array and the index is decided with zero um, I mean with j so initial value of j is zero and after each uh, I mean each after each unique element which we added in an array uh, we increment the value of j and after that i'll traverse an array from zero to uh, uh, j i mean the length of uh, so j and printed only printed the value so this is uh, the code for first uh, method which we have discussed now uh, this is this uh, next method uh, which we uh, discuss i mean uh, using hash map so here i have declared a hash map of integer and integer type so the key is integer and the value the count we maintain here is also an integer so i'll travel i have traversed an array and then what i'm checking is if the key is already present in uh, in a map so map dot contains key if the key is already present in a map then what i am doing is i'll i'm getting its current value so what's the value of key i mean what's the count of key how many times it comes in an array and then i am adding one else i'll just add the key and so if it's not present then it occur first time so i am adding key 
and putting one uh, with them so uh, let's again I am explaining this so suppose uh, this is my array so I am traversing an array so the first time uh, the first the value presented zeroth index is 5 so 5 is not present in a map so <clears throat> here 5 and we put 1 against them so 5 occur uh, once till now it occurs once in an array then the next value is 1 1 is also not present so the next one is occurred one time then two two is occurred one time six is occurred one time four is occurred one time now after adding four then in next iteration i'll also get four so i'm checking map dot contains key four so yes it contains four and what's its previous value its previous value is one now i am adding one with them so four and its value the key is 4 and its value is 2 similarly the previous value of 5 is 1 now uh, we get 5 and its value is 2 and after forming this map what I am doing is I am traversing this map this is uh, the new syntax uh, which is introduced in Java 8 so what I'm doing is so key value and I'm printing key so uh, remember what I have said uh, in a map key is always unique so I'm printing key so we get only unique element of an array and now the next the last method is uh, filter unique element using set data structure so I have declared a set here and then I am traversing an array and adding each element in a set and so set only contain unique element and once I added all the elements of an array in a set then I am printing each element and I only get unique elements so these so uh, uh, don't confuse with this syntax so this is a uh, a new uh, syntax introduced in Java 8 and in main method this is my array and I have called all the three methods here I mean uh, first one is sorting then using map and then using set so let's uh, run this code if I run this code see uh, using all the three methods I only get unique elements of an array so this is how we can uh, remove duplicate element from an unsorted array so if you face any difficulty you can ask your question uh, through comments and that's it for this video for more such uh, programming vid video uh, so you can subscribe our YouTube channel and you can also visit our uh, website which is https colon slash slash webrewrite.com thanks for watching this video